Okay, so the global food supplies. As we can see, in terms of global food consumption, the darkest colours show us that most food is consumed in North America and Western Europe. Whereas when we think about global food production, it's dominated by uh, the USA, India and China. When we think about global food insecurity, which is when people aren't sure they're going to have enough uh, food to live a healthy life, it's largely concentrated in sub-Saharan Africa. Climate is a massive factor in whether or not people have food security or enough food supply. So some countries just simply don't have a climate that is suitable for producing high crop yields. Climate change is exacerbating or making that problem even worse as more farmers are forced to farm on marginal land uh, that doesn't, very, just doesn't produce very high crop yields. As a result, you can see uh, the yields, crop yields of maize and uh, wheat globally have reduced. And finally, drought is also a massive uh, contributing factor to low crop yields. Without, with a lack of water, farmers struggle uh, to have enough water to water their crops. But mechanisation is also a factor as well, so HICs are more likely to farm using machinery, whereas LICs, people are more likely to be subsistence farming uh, with manual labour. And finally, a billion people across the world live below the poverty line. Those people will have food insecurity because they simply don't earn enough money and affording food is a daily struggle. Don't forget to